for me, like I, I start off on a 1200 and I stuck with it, but I, I know there's like this learning curve with like a higher CC, more power. Like you, I know for the training aspect, friction zones are a little bit different, throttle control, you know, just a little bit of throttle on a 1200 versus a little bit of throttle on a, on a 500 is a lot different. And one's more forgiving than the other. So like, should you start on something small? Because you're talking about possibly like going, like growing with it. So like, I mean, I, I personally think growing with a small bike is still fun because then maybe get a second one that's bigger. But um, now what, what would you recommend? Small or big CC, more power, less power? Like what's your, what's your thoughts? You know, if it's a cruiser, you could get away with, if it's a cruiser, you can get away with getting a decent size CCs, right? You could do yeah, like, the, like a 1200 um, because it's not going to have a ton of torque. You know, the bottom end's not going to be wild or crazy. Um, so we, even if you do get on the throttle, it's not like it's a thousand CC sport bike that's going to stand up on the rear and, and, and kill you. So um, mm -hmm. I think you're absolutely making a good decision. I would stay right around thousand CCs or 1200 max when it comes to a cruiser. A cruiser. So there's a difference between sport bike and cruiser. I mean, I, I know this, but it's just like, I, you know a lot more about a lot of these things. So like yeah, difference so between it, a thousand on a cruiser and a sport bike. Yeah, so if it's a V-twin or if it's a cruiser and it's geared a certain way, it's not going to generate the kind of power that, you know, a sport bike does. And those things are three-cylinder or four-cylinders and 140 horsepower, 100, you know, it's it, crazy amounts of power to where those bikes, those bikes are too much. Yeah. You know, and if you're not disciplined enough to own that bike right off the bat and not utilize how powerful they are immediately, you might kill yourself. So, um, so it's d discipline. The, I guess yeah. discipline's a big thing. Yeah, yeah. And quite frankly, there's people that have been riding sport bikes for 10, 15 years who still who still can't get all of a 750 or a thousand cc sport bike. You know? Like yeah. They so it's can really about training. Six hundred, maybe. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So, so training and discipline and and throttle control. Those are all things I talk about. Uh, when it comes to training, you know, you got to, you got to figure out what the throttle is, the friction zone. And then right. if it's a brand new bike, you got to take it easy. Um, yep. so right now what I, what I'm gathering is that if you're short, possibly get a cruiser because of the seat height, that's going to be a lot easier. And then, uh, if you have some discipline, let's say you're a short disciplined person, get it, you can get a 1200 probably or a thousand CC cruiser. Yeah. Yeah. You can step up to that as long as you are disciplined and um, you know, you, you got to learn this thing. Oh. He's got a Roo Rock, whatever. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Wee, 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 wee. It's so fun turning quickly on these things. Yeah, the wheelbase is so, so short. And the yeah.